when hair dryers won't do the job, you gotta whip out the heavy hitters. We've been in Coleman for the last four days. The snow starting to melt, but the ice is sticking around. They're having similar issues in Blunt County. WVTM 13's Lisa Crane live and local there. But folks are tired of the ice, Lisa, and who can blame them? Yeah, absolutely. You know, here in Blount County, we're on the west side of the county and schools have been closed here all week. Well, if you get one look at the roads here, you know why. There are lots of ice still left on some of these back roads and side roads. We're, we're on Highway 31 right now, not too far uh, from Top Hat Barbecue. And right here, if you were to take a left, it's dark now, but that's County Road uh, number seven. It's in bad shape right now, but it is still open. And this may be as good as it gets because the county has run out of salt to treat the roads. The ice is sticking around in Blunt County. If you can stay on, if you got to be out, don't get too comfortable because we got spaces where the road will be clear for a mile because sun's been on it. And then you hit a, a hundred foot spot of ice and you feel the brake pedal and you're wrecking. What's left could be here till it thaws on its own because the county has run through all its salt to treat the roads. We just run out of like we still had, we'll buy fresh stuff, salt mostly and I'll keep the old and we actually run out of all our fresh and then got in their old stuff where we was having busted up because if it sits here four or five years, it just, just bunches up. Ridge Drive in the village of Blunt Springs is steep and winding, not good when it's covered in ice. Several residents found that out the hard way. These are private roads, so it's up to residents to clear them. When something needs to be uh, handled, the communities come together. We've got several, uh, Healthcare workers and physicians that live here and they had to get out to see their patients. Leaf blowers were working pretty well on the hills. Yeah. But the ice on the bridge was about an inch thick, so they had to improvise. Their homemade blowtorch flamethrower did the trick. Now, like I said earlier, schools here in Blount County have been closed all week. No word about tomorrow, but if we do receive any word about school closings tomorrow, we will notify you online and on our app. Live in Blount County, Lisa Crane, WVTM 13.